you cannot change uh, the way our, we can't change the way our leaders lead. Like I wish we could, you know, no number of anonymously sent books will suddenly change the way that they lead. Um, uh, we can keep trying, but it, it won't work. Um, um, uh, we have to be the leaders we wish we had. And so we can't change the way somebody three, four, five levels above us is leading the company, but we can take responsibility for how the people to the left of us and how the people to the right of us feel when they come to work. And by the way, the person who we work for, our boss, um, they're a human being too. And though they may be difficult or sometimes maybe they're an asshole, do we really know why? Are they just a genetic asshole? They may be, it absolutely is a possibility, or maybe they're under extreme stress that we don't know about. Or maybe their bus is an extreme asshole and it just filters down. Or maybe they were never taught how to lead and they're just trying to make the best of it and they're lying, hiding, and faking every day. But there's so many reasons. And so sometimes going into our boss's office and saying, hey, you were really, you were really tough, of, tough on us in the meeting today. I just want to make sure you're okay. Are you okay? I'm worried about you. Like we've all been going through a lot during this COVID time, for example, and so have you. Um, so being a leader doesn't just mean being a leader to the people on our level. It means being a leader to the people around us. And so the way we lead from the bottom of the totem pole is the exact same way we lead from every level of the totem pole, which is uh, we take care of those around us um, and we be the leaders we wish we had. That is, leadership has nothing to do with rank. It has nothing to do with where we sit on the totem pole. It's how we take care of those around us. Remember, leadership is the awesome responsibility to see those around us rise. Mm -hmm.